It's nice to play golf with someone who's at that level. That was smashed. I have to, why do I always have to follow him? He is good. We knew it was gonna be difficult. Yep. Tyson's been smashing it probably 40, 50 yards past me. And I'm only 20 now. I'm only 20. So <laughs> what do you love about Washington golf? Yeah, I think Washington golf is super underrated. And I love how green it is year round. I think I got my sunglasses on for that wedge. What in the heck? Yeah, you like this rainbow? It's a typical day for you. Oh man, I don't think there is such thing as a typical <laughs> day in the golf industry. Deal with uh, irritating YouTubers. Yeah, 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 yeah. Deal with these guys that want to go do videos on the course. I don't know what that's all about. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Fox and Rabbit on Fox. I'm Rabbit. And today we have an awesome episode, as you saw in the description and the thumbnail. We have the Club Pro we're battling against. Tyson, Auden, come on in. Say hello. Hey guys, thanks for having me. Super excited to be with you guys today. Good day for some golf. It's beautiful out and the course is beautiful as always. And uh, you have the, the knowledge, so we're, we're gonna be battling today, right? Yes, we are. So, I know where not to hit it, so we'll go with that. <laughs> so we are gonna be playing a 2v1. Uh, we're gonna be scrambling against the pro here. We'll see how well we can do against him. And hopefully this will be a, a fun little series we're putting on this year, uh, so stay tuned. And again, great course shape, beautiful day. And if you are in the Northwest, you have to come play this ranch course. It is amazing. This 27 hole course is phenomenal. We're gonna be doing a cart interview uh, through the holes uh, with Tyson as well. Pick his brain a little bit about the place and a little yep. bit about his history. So that'll be fun. Stay tuned. Let's get started. Good kick. Yeah, it's probably just in that little collar there. Yep, yep, cool. you're good. Oh, you want me to go first? Yeah. Okay, we'll see how well this driver goes today. I went back from a Cobra Rad Speed to this R11. I'll wait, wait three holes before I pitch you on tricks on. All right. Well, I'll tell you, Brooks Kepka, <laughs> I think he did a major pitch. Yeah. God, he was smashing it. Uh -huh. That beautiful little cut. Well, I'm not as fast as Tyson. I'm a little bigger. We're just looking for straighter. And older. <laughs> go, go, get through, get through. Oh, hit it. Useful. Okay. All right, well. That's, that's birdie flats right there. Nothing to write home about there. Oh yeah. Well, there we go. Collect right there. Oh yeah. That's a good start on hole one at Lakeland. I baby. don't know Just if I'm gonna do any better than that, so we'll Well enjoy it while it lasts. Yeah, <laughs> for real. <laughs> well I guess the first thing is uh what are you what are you swinging with? What's your uh what's your clubs? Yeah, so I'm on staff with Shrixon. They've been a really good partner company for me. I really enjoy having them. Team Shrixon all the way. So off the tee there I hit my uh Shrixon ZX5 MK2 low spin driver. Um, new to me this year, really enjoy having it in my bag for sure. My favorite player is a Strixon player. I'll give you one guess. Ryan Fox. You got it, buddy, Ryan Fox. We gotta love Ryan. Was that actually right? That is right. That's you are unreal. Correct. <laughs> <laughs> That's Ryan, rad. congratulations on the new baby and uh, did, did pretty well on the uh, PGA Championship. Yeah, he's a stud for sure. He's a good dude. Yeah, long lost cousin maybe or something maybe. there. Yeah, yeah, no doubt. You pa you're past the tree, right? Oh yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Is he past the tree? Duh. Obviously taking rabbits here. Yep. 190 out, but with the blue pin, we're just gonna be over 200. Just gonna hit an easy three wood. Yep, uphill. Not like that. That's to the right again. Hold on, baby. I love that spot. You in that spot, nice. you guys are tight. I'm gonna hit a four iron. I'm just gonna try to get it back there. This hole always seems to play just a little bit longer. There you go. You're at it. Wow. Nice. 
Nice shot. That's Thank you. Right, yeah. You uh, almost made it, but it's, yeah, you're off the back. I got 137 flag, little downwind. I'm gonna play at about 135. I'm gonna hit a choke pitching wedge. Based off the shot I saw earlier, looks like it's gonna take a pretty big hop. So I'm gonna try and land it about 15 feet short, have it one hop and stop. That's gotta sit. 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 I think we're uh, both out of bounds, but it's just... just so you know, they were double cut and roll today. Now you tell me that, right? Thanks. Now. I hope we're still in. It's OB behind the green, so yeah, we'll I don't know. I don't know. I was oh, hold on. Hold oh, on. Is that you right there? I sure hope so. I think you're both in. Oh, tight. There's no way I'm in play. You're in. You're in. You're in. Wow. Ray's hilarious. Ray's been here for like, I don't know, 30 years or something. He looks like he loves his job. <laughs> he does. He's a really rad guy. If you get, to, you want to interview somebody, interview him, you'll have 25 hours of footage. <laughs> he has some stories. Yeah. Not a great look on hole one, but we'll try it here. Butter. Butter. Cleveland 60 degree, baby. <laughs> I don't know what sort of club pro marks his ball with a T. Sorry about that. I'll grab one. <laughs> you on the know next what's hole. funny is I always do that. Yeah. I, I brought I a only have a hundred ball markers in my right. bag. Probably, probably like 50 poker chips in your bag. Yeah. I was trying to be nice and uh, be more professional today, so I brought a ball marker. Nice. I brought a, a divot tool instead of a T. You know? Oh, oh man. The, the T over the divot tool is the move, though. <laughs> See? Yeah, Those divot okay. tools get stuck. They get like the sand in them. I don't like yeah. that at all. All right, so there you have it. I'm, I'm, you, <laughs> I'm, I'm doing something okay. Look at I, Fox I, getting all professional. We're going to call it the Tyson effect. The Tyson effect. Good thing effect. I got Tyson my sunglasses effect. on for that wedge. What in the heck? Yeah, you like this rainbow? Yeah. This is, is that a, the bomb tech or whatever is that is? Tech. Yeah, yeah, right this on. This is the, uh, the, cheapy, the cheapy thing. You know, I'm looking for new clubs, so. I'm playing this beautiful six on ball. There you go. Oh, that's too oh, Hit a condo. Bye. See ya. Once again, Rabbit's gonna step up here. Nice. Oh, it checked up. All yeah. right, we got a putt off. We got a putt off. I'm seeing it. I'm seeing it right here. Okay. So, like a half a ball out left. And then it's just speed. Really slow putt. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just hammer this home. Mm -hmm. Bags are packed. I send like, it, I like that home. line. That line? You like that? All right. I'll keep it. Yeah. One time. Booyah! Lightning strikes. Let's go, buddy. All right. Good putt. Your, my goal is for you not to putt today. I love that goal. <laughs> I would like that goal too. It's be nice for me, huh? Great goal. Nothing but net. Good putt, Tyson. Thank you. I was gonna say that's the only thing I warmed up with, so I ought to be able to make a putt. <laughs> huh? These weren't even open. Did you guys get crowed? <gasps> yeah, these weren't even opened. <laughs> nah, that was probably Betty. Sorry. <laughs> There goes my chips. Dang, bro. Well, I packed, I packed extra. That is That wild. sucks. So what, uh, what age did you start playing golf? Uh, my granny taught me to golf when I was five. Whoa. So I've been playing for 20 some years now. I uh, grew up playing golf in Montana, a course called Bridger Creek. Of course, very, very similar to this one. So that's kind of why I like it out here. Um, but yeah, when I was five. That is awesome. Yeah. To be fair, she taught me to golf, gamble, drink, and fly fish. All at different stages in my life, but <laughs> she definitely did teach me all of those things. <laughs> the play here is either a tight draw or a massive slice. Pick one or the other. <laughs> Ah, oh, that's pretty. That's just. So that's how you're supposed to do it. That's All just right. nice to watch. Broken clocks right twice a day. <laughs> no glove. Good thing it's in your back pocket though. Yep. We don't need it. That way I have an excuse when I miss. We like that. I should have that glove. Well, on. I told you either draw or slice. Keep going. 
Oh, I heard tree. And another one. All right. Well, buddy. You are in Azkaban, my friend. All right. Mine's not going to matter. Well. <laughs> Mine's not going to matter. Get your martini tea. Yeah. That's uncharacteristic. Ah, it's fine. Nice and soft there. All right. We'll have a shot from there. Good luck. How long have you been at Lakeland now? Um, I'm approaching about a year and a half in my, my time at Lakeland. It's been a really good year and a half, definitely a really busy year and a half, but uh, it's been great. I've really enjoyed it. Awesome. What brought you here? Um, honestly, I, I had really never heard of the course until I was approached with the, with the job offer for the head pro position, and I came and checked it out with my dad. Um, and we just instantly, like I said, reminded me of my home course and, and really liked the opportunity and obviously loved the area, so we kind of went for it. Where where do you come in from? Um, I was originally at Gold Mountain Golf Course just down the road uh, near Bremerton before coming here. Um, and I uh, was there for a little a little under a year before before making the move. Is that me there? Yeah, that's cool. Right, right in the middle. I'm not surprised. I am. You can cut the ball, dog. So... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Go. We need your cut. All right. Yep. Let's just cut it. I only got you by 80 this time. <laughs> yeah. Just a little. Uh, I don't know if you folks caught that, but I was just reminded about how far I got out drove. You got enough zoom on that camera for that? <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Love it. Oh, come on. Uh, come on. Feed. Work, going. Feed. work it. Keep Feed going. in there. Feed in there. Nope. Contact. Man, almost. You flushed that. You hit that really good. Thanks. Yeah, it's just on that left lie, though. So. Are we in play? Uh, I, I give it about a 5% chance. Rabbit really wants to impress you today, just FYI. <laughs> <laughs> so far, so good. <laughs> I mean, you already did if the Nick Faldo shoe was there. That's good stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Late, late night infomercial. Boy. If I wore those shoes, I would play Two better. for one. What? Wow. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Get to my ball. Get to his ball. Sit. Oh, don't go out. No, that's You're fine. Good. You're just being right. some rough. You're good there. Though. And Rabbit keeps leaving his rangefinder on the carts every time we play. I so. love that feature and hate that feature at the same time. It is brutal. <laughs> I've probably gone through three or four rangefinders because of that. <laughs> Thankfully, he always finds it here because you, you guys are awesome, but. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad that's worked out then. That's good. They're a little late. They were pro probably going to give our send off at the first hole, but. <laughs> Got 200 flag, downwind, front pin, probably going to play at about 190 here. We'll see how we do. Get a kick. One kick. Move it left. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, God. So what is your uh, favorite hole on the course? My favorite hole on the course, it's a toss up. I do really enjoy our signature hole on the course, which is hole five, kind of that downhill par five that it is short, but it's, uh, it's a tricky one. Um, but I also really enjoy another par five, which is on the back, hole 17. Um, oh, yeah. Kind of just an absolute doozy of a golf hole, but really, really fun to play. We try to cut that corner every time and it never works. Yeah, it never works. Yeah, <laughs> I've done it maybe a couple times, but uh, I've had some others on that hole for sure. All right, Fox. Nice little uphill lie. Get it lofted in the air for you. Get the shoulders cracking. That was good. Yeah. It's called age. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, you'll experience it. It's good enough. It's coming. <laughs> mm. Cut. Cut. Cut in there. Cover You're it. On a right. Cut in Cover there. It. Cut in there. In the sand. Hmm. Hello. Too much. I think you're uh, Pin high? You're near the dance floor. That was a good looking shot. Thanks, man. Yep. Yeah, I'm not helping today. It's coming. It's coming, bro. It's coming. Yeah, I felt good. I thought that was going to cut. It just went straight. We got to make a putt here. Because <laughs> par fives, I think we're going to be uh, a little behind the eight ball. <laughs> yeah, I think, uh, we're, I think we're outgunned on that one. Yeah. Tie with a eagle putt. 
How huh. dare you, sir? Good shot. Thank you. Okay. Come on. Got it. Come on. Bang. Come on. <sighs> Mommy. That was right where you told him. That was a great putt. I think just speed. Buddy, you nailed the line. It was just speed. Yeah. Beautiful putt. <laughs> that had eyes, brother. Saw yours go by. Yeah. Yeah, that was not a great effort. All right. You're all right if I'm behind. I'll oh, I'm stay great. Still. Yeah, you you can do whatever. I don't care. Unless this doesn't go in, then it's your fault. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Ah. Uh, what did I just get done telling you? Ah. Uh, doesn't break. That of course is good. Thank you. Three twenty down the middle would be nice right about now. That was not pretty, but it's functional. Position A on the left. I about missed that golf ball. <laughs> <laughs> so we got a I got a GC three simulator upstairs last winter and had a winter simulator league. It was pretty good. Definitely done a lot of club fittings, a lot of lessons on it, which has really helped. Um, it's been a lot of fun for me getting to play it in some of my off hours to work on my game a little bit. Awesome. Um, but yeah, it's definitely been a huge benefit to us for sure. Yeah, they definitely help. They are invaluable, yep. Yeah. And ours we can take inside or, or take it outside as well, which is really cool. That's pretty cool. Oh, Damn it, keep doing that. Boy, you caught that. That's in the middle of the fairway. Yeah. That's fine. Buddy, that 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 might be an option. That is one of those that's so bad it's good. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Beauty. That's perfect. Beauty. Don't do anything funky. No funky right. business. Hold yeah. The there it nice is. Nice ball. Yep. Yay. Beauty, dude. You might have got me there. <laughs> Enjoy it while it lasts. Yeah, if I got you, that's it. I'm heading to the clubhouse having a beer. That's a hand me out. What uh, what course around the world have you enjoyed playing the most? Besides, obviously here. Yeah, as much as I love Lakeland, I've gotten a really cool opportunity to play a lot of neat golf courses. I would say my uh, my favorite course that not a lot of people know about is I've got to play the reserve at Moonlight Basin in Big Sky, Montana. Ooh. I actually got to work there. Uh, it's a course that's 8,000 yards at 8,000 feet elevation, so it's a uh, bomber's paradise. Really hard course, shot one of my uh, better rounds there, and it was in 81, which sounds crazy, but uh, it was just playing that hard. Yeah. Um, really beautiful course, definitely unheard of. Uh, that's probably my favorite, for sure. Cool. Yeah, they have like members fly in uh, on helicopters to that course. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's awesome. I was feeling good about myself until, until I saw, saw Tyson's. Until yeah. you saw I tried to I tried to miss it. I tried. <laughs> he it even his miss out drives Even his us. miss. I mean the, like tricks on. They're 40 yards. It must be the tricks on. The tricks on. Yeah. You Wait. are about 205, I would say, flag with a little headwind. Um, luckily you've got a good angle, but that's about all you got. That's all we got. Yeah. Luckily it's dried out quite a bit. Course isn't rolling, so you can chase this bad boy up there, no doubt. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> Ready? Really like the rights today. Yeah. Consistent. Consistently. <laughs> consistently bad. <laughs> Flushed it. Oh. Well, I went Good for a news. little cut and it cut. You cut it. Rats. <laughs> Never <a> doubt. <laughs> ah. Because I we have to keep grabbing my ball, because. <laughs> <laughs> ah, oh, man, I gotta start contributing here. Usually takes me about three holes. <laughs> you think I'd learn that. All right, I got a 165 flag, probably trying to hit at 160. Hopefully it can do better than the kind of concept of the first hole, we'll see. Ah, sit. Just Down. left of it. 
Oh, crushed oh, you it. caught that. Crushed it, crushed it. Yeah. It's giving us life. Yeah. He's being too kind. Yeah, he's being nice. Absolutely flushed that shot. That was money. Yeah. That was nice to watch. I love, uh, his swing is so, it's just so butter. It's watching his swing is just, yeah. I feel a lesson is coming in my future. Mm-hmm. Little tree that left. Oh, come on, come on. No, that's come a down. look. Come down. Not that left. Okay. All right. Release cracking. Oh, William. William, William, William. Come on, buddy. Okay. Ah. Go in. Oh. Get in the hole. Shoot. One of the most important things, Tyson, is what you're doing, right? Yes, sir. Take care of your courses. Take care of you. Yeah. Although I just hit that to 30 feet, so I don't know about that, but <laughs> still good nonetheless. It's for the next time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. <laughs> no, our maintenance guys do a good job, so I always like to try and help them out, help them keep it good. No way. Heck of a putt. Thanks. Yeah, buddy, I like that line. You got this. Mm. Love it. Yeah. As a push. Yeah. Stay up. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Rats. Freaking. They're, they'll clean it up they'll for clean you. Clean it up. Man alive. That is wild. What the heck? Uh -huh. Well, the crows got it. Closed bag. That ain't great. They're eating good tonight. It's all right. I'm your car kid tonight, so. <laughs> All right, I got my ZX utility iron, a two iron here. I'm gonna just kind of try and sting one right down the middle. Pretty short par four, so should be simple here. That will work. That is gonna run for days. That's a, that's a Palm Springs ball. <laughs> You know, playing here in, in January and then just seeing the course dry out, the greens I, firm like, up. You get like four courses for the price of one out here. Yeah, yeah. it's yeah. amazing. Yeah. Legit, yeah. <laughs> it's fun playing it when it's wet too because it makes it harder. Yeah, big time. Even in the winter, this is a, a course is immaculate. I mean, yeah. you can't do anything about the rain. No. Yeah, no, I agree. I, I think especially if you went and videoed the, the maintenance shed, you'd be pretty impressed. Yeah. Keep doing it. <laughs> Look out, Sharon. Sorry. Yeah. I heard rough. Just keep. Better than, ah! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Talk about perfectly missed. Oh, that's the spot over there. That is perfect. You just went between two branches. You just flirted with chaos. <laughs> You flirted with chaos. <laughs> well, I almost just turned around and said, uh, Tyson's two up. <laughs> so, not wow. yet. Not yet. All right. The dream is alive. All right. Yikes. That's going to work out, but jeez. Like it's, it. it's a different course from the Blues, I tell you. It's going to be fun to play the Blues this summer. But uh, yeah, it, uh, different shots. Got to get one back. We got we to gotta throw a dart here. We gotta throw a dart. Well, at least I got his two iron. <laughs> I got, uh, I forgot what I have, but I have a number. 146. Gonna, 146. Gonna, okay. To the pin. And I'll try and hit it within 80 yards of that. <laughs> <laughs> That's not within 100. Yikes. Saddle. Goodbye. See you later. <laughs> you guys are all square, I think. We got to do something here, Foxy. Aye. We got to do something here, Fox. You watch Michael Block. Did that give you like any kind of, I mean, this, that had to have felt, cause he, he yeah. you know, this is to all my boys, all my PGA professionals. Yeah, he's also um, like, that was his fifth PGA championship. 
Wow. So a lot of people think that like that was like his first go at it. I mean, he is unbelievable. He is, he has been and is really good at golf. Yeah. Um, I would say of the PGA professionals, he's top. He's in the top. He's top one, you know, even top half percent of PGA professionals. But wow. for him to give us all a shout out and, and to say, you know, this one's for you guys and, and to get that respect from a lot of other people is really cool. That was and, class uh, And he was, I mean, it was just so cool watching that. Yeah. Um, that hole in one was bonkers. Yeah, my argument is that he is one of the, the a couple PGA professionals that truly could probably play on tour. Okay. Um, he's really good. I don't think know that he'd tell you that because uh, he's just so whatever. But yeah. uh, I mean, shoot, he hit like a couple buckets of balls, you know, for his practice. Like he's not out there grinding like those guys. Go, go. Yeah. Go. One hop. Go. Oh, oh, come on. Bunkage? Yeah. Safely aboard. Okay. Climb. Climb. Didn't. That's a great putt, dude. Nice putt. That's a great putt, dude. Great putt. Oof. Putt. Really good putt. Got good, it. Good par, boys. Yuck. All right, all square. Well done. All right. Ready. That was a gift. A very big yeah, gift. Yeah, that's, that's all you guys get. <laughs> that's the only one we're getting. That's, that's all we get. That's all we get. All right, so here's a guess. I'm guessing Tyson will have, from the tips, We'll have about 150 in. I'm going to be happy if we have 200 in. Prediction. I'm cruising at like 2100 spin probably with this driver, which is solid. That is, oh, that's, great. that's money. I can also hit it with like 800 if I wanted to, which is what I'm going to try and do here. Okay. <laughs> so who's your uh, favorite pro golfer? Favorite pro golfer is an easy one. That's Rory McIlroy, no yeah. matter what. Uh, yeah. Always has been, always will be. Uh, recently though, um, I got to give a big shout out to Joel Damon and Max Homa. Those two guys are rad. Joel Damon's caddy, University of Idaho guy, so I have a big connection there. Um, but yeah, I would say Rory. I'd cut off my arm for him to win the Masters, and everyone that knows me knows that. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Were you a Vandal? Uh, yeah, I am a Vandal, University of Idaho. Nice. Yep. Okay. Yep. try it just for shoots and gigs pretty much don't really try to do this on this hole but because we're having fun out here I'm gonna try and hit my uh, stinger drive which has a success rate of about 12% but when it works it's really cool so here we go Love it. oh run forest kick. A kick. yep roll down. that's really good I love how when you go on the left side of this hole, it just funnels all the way to the right. Oh, you hit it in the middle of the fairway on the, you're even out. you're out of bounds. Yeah. yeah, I experienced that my first time. Yeah. I was like, that's such a good yeah. drive. And then well, and that's what I love about this hole is that it, it, it looks like it's begging you to hit it in the middle of the fairway, but that's just such a rookie mistake. Yeah, definitely kind of that left cut right there on the collar is really good. It's a hot spot there. Gosh, if I got a little roll right, I'm probably inside 150 yards. That's what, I, that was my prediction. Uh, I put you. At, I put you at 150. I think the shortest I've had in here is about 85, <laughs> with some wind help for sure. Um, but I've hit it. I've hit it every square inch of this golf course. So 85. my average is who knows what. <laughs> That's awesome. All right. Yeah. Enough of this. Enough of this rights. Yep. Almost. Heads up, Abel. Jeez. Getting close. Getting closer, buddy. Let me the bill. We'll save your swing tips till the end of the round. Can't give you any advice mid-round. What's going on, Martini T? Gosh, do we got to go to a brush tee? I don't know. <laughs> you pull out a brush tee, I'm probably out of here. Yeah. No, I don't use brush tea. I'm probably out of here. <laughs> a brush tee. That would be funny. I uh, clean up your tee boxes here a lot. And just go harvest them. And I harvest. I'm like... the classic dude asking for a tee on the first hole. I actually found three in our garbage bin this morning that I'm using. So. <laughs> 
Yeah, par threes, I don't bring a tee. I just search for a broken one. Yeah. Oh, William. Uh-oh. Soft. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Good boy. I think we're in trouble. Oh, boy, really. Ryan Fox. Ryan Fox, shout out. We're gonna what have to, legend. we're gonna try to get him on the channel. I'm yeah. just gonna try. Yeah. Tricks, Tricks on. on. If you're watching, we need to we need to get hooked up with Mr. Fox to Kieran, play on Kieran, plug us into Ryan, man. That's right. I love those Strixon Q-Star divides. Yeah, they're I, good, aren't they? I mean, obviously, I don't have the swing to really showcase them right now, but... Yeah, but I think that's a good ball for your swing. You're kind of cruising around in the in the 90 mile an hour swing range, which is exactly what that ball is looking to help with, so... Yeah, uh, yeah. I love it putting, too. Yeah, putting is yeah. really fun. Oh, yeah. I didn't get down the hill. Lucky for you, boys. Yeah. But we're in play on hole five is good. If this rough were any thinner, I'd have been in their backyard. Oh, for sure. Yeah, we, we, we're we growing it out. It's a healthy rough right now. All right, my friend. That cutter and buck, that three wood cutter and buck. You got this. This. We got cutter and buck in our golf shop too, by the way. Love cutter and buck. I've seen one albatross and it was probably the coolest shot in golf that I've ever seen. Out here or? No, I mean, at a course back in Montana. One of my buddies cracked a Coors Light after being like seven over through three and uh, has 245 to the hole, hits a four iron to straighten to the hole and makes it for a two. Shut uh, it, was, <laughs> it was rad. That was not an ad for Coors Light, by the way, but <laughs> yeah, man, it's way. a pretty good reason to buy one, I think. Yeah. My goodness. Yes. Oh, man. That's what I'm talking about. That's my partner. Right in between that bunker. Yeah, Go. It's going to leave you a weird shot, but that was hit so well. Great Played swing. Out. Atta boy. Yeah, that was cool. There you go, watch. Foxy. Right there. All Powered right. by rocket balls. What was that about a 50 footer? Hop up. Hop. Ah, soft. Good shot, though. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. From back here, that's all right. Jack McLaughlin. Okay, they're four years apart. Two double eagles. Legendary. All right, Jack, let me see what you got. <clears throat> That's pretty cool. Okay, I got 185 here downhill, probably playing 175. Definitely a weird shot between seven and eight iron. I'm gonna try and take something off of seven. I'm um, kind of looking the windows between the bunker and the flag there. Try and hit a feathery fade in there. Again, all of that's in, in principle here, we'll see. <laughs> Go. Money. Go. Dang it. Go. Be good. Oh, what a hop. Oh, what a hop. Great shot. Thank you. So you don't you don't play spikes? No, no, I'm all about the kick game. I don't I don't believe in spikes. Huh. Um, I guess in the winter I'll wear G4s, which have a little more spike. Yeah. But I'm much more worried about style than than anything. I love it. So. Very opposite of me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the functionality I appreciate though. <laughs> well, up and down here. Up and down would be noise. We yeah. need it. See, the rabbit's getting serious now. We got about 15 feet. Piece so, we definitely want, don't want to be above it. I'd say anything inside 20 feet from where y'all are really good. Agreed. Even if you just stay in the fringe is good. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it lands on that. Excuse me, it lands on that. It's, it's gone. Oh yeah. It's rolling 100%. out. Okay. All right, pal. All right, buddy boy, if you go just a little bit left of the pin, it's gonna break right. What a shot here. Well, it's kind of an auto, it's kind of an auto birdie for, for Tyson, so we gotta get it in there. Wow. Check, 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 check. Go in. Oh, oh mommy, sit, 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 sit. This is pretty good. A little, little hard. Honestly, a foot softer in that fringe was really yeah, good. Boy. That was, that was a great was, try. That was a really good try. Ugh. That was close, dude. Whoa. Nope. Been a lot. Bye bye. Hello. Got it there. Woo! Keeping you boys alive. <laughs> you are. Man. You're being too kind. Here? Is that about 18 inches? Yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on. Wow. The putt. 
Come on. Really good <laughs> that was luck. good. That was good. Good putt. That's good. All right. Good par, boys. A little longer than we want left here. Not a problem, but not a problem. We got it. It's a typical day for you. Oh man, I don't think there is such thing as a typical <laughs> day in the golf industry. Um, I don't know, I usually show up about 6.45, 7 o'clock, <laughs> sort of let the day come to me. I tend to do about everything in a day. I'll check in customers, I'll do lessons, I'll do club fittings, I'll sell memberships, I'll do merchandising, I'll help our food and bev team. Um, I usually just like to check in with my team, see how they're doing in the morning, and then get some work done throughout the day. But uh, there is no such thing as a typical day here, um, which is what makes it fun. It's what I like about it, for sure. Deal with uh, irritating YouTubers. And... Yeah, 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 yeah. Deal with these guys that want to go do videos on the course. I don't know what that's all about. But that's all right. <laughs> What's your lo lowest round scored, and where was it at? <laughs> Everyone that knows me knows this story, and I'm sure I'll catch a lot of flack for it. But... Uh, I shot 65 at uh, Gamble Sands in a, in a college tournament uh, my, my freshman year of college. Um, and that is my only hole-in-one, too. I had a hole-in-one mid-round. I went 38-27, uh, which is, if you know me, too, that's also what I tend to do. Either way, could go better or worse, worse, better, whatever. Yeah. But I'm typically the tail of two nines. Um, it was a lot of fun, really good round. Gamble's obviously such a great course and is, and is really fun to go out and play. But... Uh, Done that, and then I've had a few 65s on my home course. My lowest out here is a 68, which I shot just the other day. Um, but uh, this course is hard. This course is, uh, it's short, but it's got teeth that yeah. uh, you don't see coming until it's usually too late. <laughs> yeah. Because you do, you take a look at the card, and especially on the back nine with those those shorter, tight par fours, and you're like, oh man, I'm gonna, yeah. I'm gonna shred this course. And then you uh, yeah. get there and you're like, OB left, OB right. And then you, you mm -hmm. get to the green, like the green on 14 I mean, is the no back joke. nine greens are crazy. Yeah, I, um, they're brutal. I definitely <laughs> have just blown some rounds just because I refuse to lay up on those holes and I'll hit driver and it's just not really a driver <laughs> hole. Uh, when I do, like I said on five, when I do pull it off, it's a lot of fun, but uh, it's tough to pull off. Yeah. I think I've driven almost every one of those short par fours on the back, but I've also made nines on all of those holes too. So, yeah. and that's yeah. what I love about Lakeland is that it thou giveth and thou taketh away, right? So, <laughs> yep. Um, super, super fun to play. The back nine is definitely less scorable than the front nine. Um, front nine's really gettable, but not today it seems. <laughs> That's money. Wow. That's a really good shot. Go. Oh. Get in there. That's a great oh, shot. Wow. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Yep. Oh boy. Uh-huh. Okay. Here That's though. bunker. Nestle yourself right there. Bunker. Ah. <laughs> Trying something, little, little punch, did not work out. Oh, and he is just super tight. Yeah, that's wow. a birdie. That's a birdie. Well, mine did not draw, it cut into the bunker, so. Oh, man. Well, we're out. Yeah, spin. Yeah. Ooh. Sit. That's, well done. Right. Scared it. Sink it so it don't matter for us, please. Yeah, I'll try my best here. Yeah. Good roll. These clubs gonna be okay for you guys? Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> I sure hope we don't hit those. I'm thinking right here, buddy. All right, that's where I have it. Okay, okay you have it here. I have it just right of that. Okay. If you feel confident with that, roll it. It's definitely 
straighter than you think. Oh, is it? Oh, is yeah, it? I good. think what he like what Fox was saying there is good. I don't think it's outside of that hole. I was thinking two balls left. You think it, it's not? I'm gonna go there. It's one ball, maybe a ball and a half. I'm gonna go there, there, and you just watch it. Okay. Yeah, you're. Yeah, you're. You're right at the left edge. Yeah. Okay. All right. I'm gonna go there. Let's see how she rolls. I feel it now. A little more. I like that. I like that, dude. Hold on. Good thought. We don't want to go dormy, so. You're only one down. Yeah, we're only one, yeah. Might feel more, but you're only one. Oh, no, three holes left. Three holes left. <laughs> yeah. My bad. I mean, I expected to get beat, but not that much. <laughs> we got it. Nice pot. Good Brother. save. Woo! Nice. Sandy. I was between clubs there. Um, it was 162, probably playing 165. That's between a nine and an eight. Yeah. Um, I took my nine, so I took more. And anytime I, or I took less. And anytime I'm trying to really hit one there and trying to flight it, pierce against the wind, I'm going to play it off my back foot, with my shaft forward. I'm going to try and flight it down like a line drive. Okay. So you kind of saw that one kind of curve and be lower. Yeah. If I were you and I would have taken more of the club, I would try and put that off my front foot and kind of get it up in the air a little bit more to have that wind knock it down. So okay. almost the opposite of what you tried to do. Okay. Um, so yeah, if I were to hit the seven there, in your case, if you were to hit a seven, I'd put off my front foot and I'd choke down like a quarter inch of my grip. Okay. Holy cannolis. Yeah, that's that's Pop. pretty. Go! Go! That'll work. That was smashed. I have to why do I always have to follow him? <laughs> <laughs> I did it again, man. What is the deal? I'm focusing so hard not to do that. Yes, sir. Beauty. I'm glad I came out to film. Because <sighs> I ain't doing nothing today. <laughs> Dude, nice drive. Needed that, buddy. I'm really, really needed that. Sorry I'm not showing up today, man. Hey, you know what? That's okay. We're, we're one down. That was a big putt on that par three. It's nice to play golf with someone who's at that level. You know, somebody who's a plus three, plus four and just does different shots, you know, isn't just trying to hit it in the fairway, but is trying to shape it certain ways to put them on certain sides of the fairway. It really is just fun to watch. You know, go see your club pro, get some lessons, go play around. Go, go play around with them, get some on-course tips. It, it's, it's really fun. Okay, right. I would actually like this to, to, to be on video. Uh, Tyson's been smashing it probably 40, 50 yards past me. And I'm only 20 now. I'm only 20. <laughs> so, <laughs> woo! Woo! I'll take it! Come on. Get Kick a little left. love. Kick Come left. on. Get a little Kick love. Left. Go left. Kick left. Come on. Yeah. Come on down. Come on down. Hey. All right. I did say that you'd be playing against him today, and I would just be giving him <laughs> some reads on the putting green, right? Hey, man. I call it. A little call Batman, it little Batman it. Robin scenario going on here. <laughs> Same thing, just a little bit more pin high. All right, two looks. You like that size. Sit. Oh, that's pretty. That was lucky. That was pretty. That was really lucky. It grabbed right there at the end and Yeah, I didn't think back. it was gonna. That was good, we'll take it. How many maintenance uh, crew do you have here? Gosh, depending on the season, we can have anywhere from a skeleton crew of about three or four and all the way upwards of about 10. 
Um, still not enough even in season, but those guys do a really good job. As you guys have seen all day, the course is in really good shape. Um, we are really lucky to have the guys on the maintenance crew that we do, so shout out to them for they, sure. They really do an awesome job. We, yep. we play a lot of places, but we film mainly here because it's just the best course to film at. No, we, we appreciate that. Yeah, I've got the easy job. They've got the hard job. As we see Austin out here ahead of us watering these tee boxes, making sure they're good. So, yeah. shout, shout out, to, out the to them. Crew. Yep. Yeah. Well, buddy, we got to make a putt. Yeah, we do. He's in tight. That's a gimme. You guys seem like you like the pin in, yeah? Yeah. Cool. Yeah, we're lazy. Hey. <laughs> uh, well, Fox, I'm lazy. Fox is rubbing off on me. <laughs> good thing you didn't uh, try and do this a couple years ago. Yeah. Got to go. Got to go. Well, that was it. Line. I had to go. Buddy. That's pretty good. That's good, good line. That's a good par. Well done. Poop. <laughs> Poop indeed. Well, good par, boys. Wanted to get it there. Yeah, I respect the effort. What do you think, Fods? Fox odds? About 100%. I think 100%? 100's generous. Yeah. I'm going to go 75. I think he's got this, though. I'm going 42. <laughs> <laughs> One hundred percent. What do I win? <laughs> <laughs> now we're dormy. Yeah. He is good. We knew it was gonna be difficult. Yep. Especially when I'm not playing. <laughs> Oh, where's the fade? Sit. Sit. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna hit a six. You got a T already? Right here. Good. It's ready for me. Hello. Come on, baby. Oh, just dead straight. Ah. Oh. That was a beautiful swing. Nice shot. Really okay, good. buddy. We got a putt. Yep. Sometimes there's the trampoline. See that? <laughs> oh. What's the, uh, so you've obviously played around the, around the world a little bit with golf. What do you love about Washington golf? Yeah, I think Washington golf's super underrated. It doesn't, uh, well, we've hosted, you know, maybe one major championship, a couple other tour events, but golf in Washington's super good. Um, I love how green it is year round. Like even out here in the middle of winter, I'm so used to stuff being brown. The, the level of green out here is really cool. Um, it's just some really hidden gems, us being one of them, but I mean, within, within 20 minutes of here, you've got a bunch of great courses all around. So I think Washington golf needs to get a little more love and uh, hopefully not too much because we don't want people to take over. But uh, we, do, we do have a good couple courses around here for sure. Yeah, I'm tired of uh, all the, uh, the Texas uh, YouTube and Florida YouTubers getting yeah, all the love. Yeah, obviously need... great courses out there. But I, I think, you know, Washington, even before I moved out here, I had known that golf was good out here. And I, I definitely am glad I moved out here because it's awesome. Yeah, we get, yeah. Some, we get some love in the Northwest here on some YouTube. Yeah, I love it. Got all work cut out for us. Yeah, we do. We got a long one. We got a long one. Oh. That's a great roll, dude. Really good putt. Ah, oh, I tried, buddy. Try it. I want to have Tyson ring the bell. <laughs> I want to ring it for Bobby. Yep. <laughs> break in, break in, break in. Woo! Buddy, that was sick. <laughs> Good match, boys. That was a great match. Ah, oh, great you. match, Tyson. Thank Good you, thank grief. you. <laughs> wow.
Wow. That was a nice putt. Thanks, folks, for watching. That was quite a match. Uh, big ups for Tyson here. Put a, put a whooping on us. Ended with two birdies Thank in a you. row. That was pretty sweet. I told you I'd give you a gift. I gave you one gift, yeah. and that was about That's it. That's it. We got one gift. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. He's but... a swell guy. <laughs> All the information for Lakeland Village will be uh, posted. And uh, if you get a chance, uh, please come out, folks. The greens are running, as you will see in the video, as you just saw, running very fast, very true. And um, it's a great time out here. So thanks again for tuning in. Yep, click on those links, check them out, check Tyson out. If you need any lessons, this guy's your man. Yep, come I got see. lessons, we got tea times, we got food, we got beer, we got whatever you guys need. So come on out and check us out. We'd love to have you guys out here. We love the Birdie Bell here at Lakeland Village. Hope you're home, Bob.